we don't need this video. Alright, welcome everybody, let's play Shadow the Hedgehog. Now I'm usually all for watching intro sequences, but I just watched that three times over. I'm trying to get the video and audio direct from my PS2, which just miraculously started working on their own. I can't even remember the- no, we're not playing the title sequence again. I have not played my PS2 for god knows how long, so uh... I'm just gonna look at the options like I am want to do whenever I first play a game after a very long time. Deutsch. Spoken language. I can change the subtitle in spoken languages differently. It's nice. Don't be digital. Hmm. So yes, this is the uh, you could say infamous game, Shadow the Hedgehog. Uh, I'd, I'd say it's really just what made Sha Shadow disliked. Kind of, he already didn't have the best reputation, but in the in the end, I'd say this game was a good thing. Cause it finally kind of ended the whole sh Shadow arc that everybody seemed to hate. I don't really disagree with them. I have to admit. I do like the backstory for Shadow, though. wasn't handled too particularly well, but I find it to be a fun enough game to play. It's the only thing I can remember. That gruesome image. Obligatory. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave it there. The word obligatory. Maria! I'm gonna shut up and let you actually watch the cutscene now. Why can't I is this Maria? I will say, there is some very nice detail in this cutscene. Though the spontaneity of this whole, of the plot, kind of is off putting to me. Shao's just thinking on a hill, and then suddenly, aliens! The aliens are related to what Shadow is thinking. Oh yeah, I'll totally do that. How do you know I'm Shadow? And what are you talking about? And explosions. Just what was that all about? If he says he knows the truth about who I am, then like it or not, I have to believe him. The only way I'm gonna get the secrets to my past is to get those chaos emeralds. Shadow's mouth looks so weird there. I don't know why it is. I'm kind of amused by how much attention is put into Shadow having fangs in this game. Alright, so this is the layout of uh, the levels. In most levels you can make a choice as to what path you take uh, that will lead you to whatever other level. I'm going to go for uh, Hero first uh, the first time, yeah. But I'm not going to go for Pure Hero and everything because uh, to be honest, I actually have never been able to do one of the hero missions, so I'm just kind of like go neutral at one point. Skip over that. Nothing too terribly impressive about this game, I have to say. Uh, nothing new for gameplay uh, in terms of Sonic game. Uh, I guess firearms. Uh, I guess you'd say there's the warping systems too. Well, there is the whole, uh, chaos meter thing, but it's not, nothing too particularly interesting. Where is, there you go. I need to kill all these things, so I don't need Sonic making me not able to see it. So what you, uh, and the way your score works is, you have each mission, so you have evil, neutral, uh, hero. You can actually change by doing that, and Zong will just disappear. But 
what you want to do is, if you are with a particular side, for instance, I am with uh, heroes right now, uh, I want to get all good points uh, and no bad points, as any evil points will be uh, deducted from my score. Oh yes, from what I've heard, just a random chaos symbol here. By the way, both forces will attack you regardless of your karmic standing, which can be a huge pain. From what I've heard, you actually there's actually supposed to be a chaos symbol like that in every single level, but this wasn't limited, so it was just kind of there. Ow! Also, you only lose like 10 rings or so each time you get hit. I'm gonna start off with. I'm just gonna start off with full on hero and then uh, from there onwards uh, get slightly and slightly more and more evil. Yes, um. Fill the. Man. The camera's actually quite a pain to operate. Fill the... Whoa, I didn't mean to do that. Fill the blue meter and uh, you will get... Well, whatever, I'm gonna refill for ammo anyways. What's this? Ooh. Also, you float when you're shooting. But, uh... Evil... That didn't go much for me will give you, uh, the evil meter if you fill it up all the way will give you, I see just bombless pits everywhere, will give you chaos blast, which just is pretty self-explanatory. You just make everything explode. Uh, probably a good idea to actually, no, no, be using the weapon of the enemies that I'm attacking. Now, hey, gone, don't shoot me, I'm helping you. Uh, whereas... Yeah. Hero will, will uh, fill up the blue gauge, will give you the slight, give you the slightly less useful, yeah, trick me over myself. Um, chaos, what is it? Dash or something? Something weird. Um, ability. Where you'll just kind of zip forward in a level. Which, uh, most of the time is actually not something you want to do anyways. Uh, I have plenty of else, so I'm not going to pick that thing up. I don't know what that gun's like. There is a decent variety of, uh, weaponry in this game. Nothing... Not very many of them are too interesting. Like, I'm not going to use this right now, actually. Uh, you are also invincible in doing these, and you have infinite ammo. That was a bad idea. Yeah, see, it does that. Which, right there, was a really bad idea. Because I actually need to kill as many... Uh, I need to actually kill... God. Every single... Uh, black arm, whatever they're called. Destroy it. Actually, I don't... Those things give me good karma and I don't want to fill a blue gauge, so whatever. So many lasers. Yes, these keys. If you pick up all five of them in a level, you can open some random door that will oftentimes have something completely useless in it. So I suppose I could uh, mention that uh, there are a couple different types of weapons. This is apparently a pistol. Uh, there are pistols, RPGs, uh, a couple special weapons and melee weapons, uh, semi-automatics as well. Ow. Well, I can't get that key, because I'll get braided by Sonic. Awesome. Although, something nice is that you can actually teleport backwards if you need be at these save points. Uh, for the sake of... Uh, pick up anything that you had missed. The gun that that dropped is not one that I can use. Oh, shut up, Black Doom. I don't want you. Doom's eye, whatever. So I'll be learning about, more about all this stuff later. You can do this for some reason. 
It's fun. You kill things. We need assistance. I'm not giving to giving it to you. I'm just killing things. What? Okay, I, I just lost rings without flinching. Oh yes, these shadow boxes. Yes, there's nothing in them right now, but uh, later on. Okay, does Sonic just get attacked by a gun member? Because that's stupid. Uh, later on, when after you complete uh, one of the endings or go through the story mode once or twice. Uh, you will unlock a weapon for every single ending that you get, and or a uh, weapon upgrade. So, uh, and said weapons will be dropped in those shadow boxes, or boxes with shadow faces on them. They are quite nice weapons too. I'm only three of them. It just gives you a jeep right there, which is actually exactly what you have right here. So yes, there are also weapons, not weapons, well, yes, there are indeed weapons, there are also, uh, uh, vehicles in this game, but, uh, very rarely are they actually anything you want to use, I find. Um, if you're not required to use one, or if it doesn't give you a huge advantage, I find that it's generally best to not use those. Hello. I don't really like this mission, because, uh, you're not paying attention to what you're doing. If you actually go hit the finish, you will uh, just automatically complete the uh, neutral mission, whether or not you were trying to. And if you're trying to complete uh, either the good or evil mission, it takes a long time. It's just a gener general pain because you have to kill every single enemy. Over time, it seems, if you uh, stick to a particular karmic alignment, you enemies uh, that are allied to you, because that's not Oxymoron at all, uh, will stop attacking you, it seems. Oh, come on! Damn, light... <laughs> I managed to hit a light pose. Beautiful. I might as well take advantage of... Yeah, don't hit this casting roll here if you don't want to do the neutral mission. Sort of jump down over here. This isn't actually a loop, contrary to what it might look like. No. This actually leads to another area. Where a couple more enemies are for us to kill. The last few, actually. There we go. Oh god, I just dropped 2,500 frames. Sorry about that. Well, I say just, but Disgusting I don't know when that was. Creatures. Get out of my sight. So your, uh... The score of the opposite karmic standing that you took in the end is actually subtracted from your score. Uh, your total score, that is. So you do really have to go all the way in one karmic standing, or karmic direction. Bit of a pain when it comes to getting a good rank, but I don't care about ranks in Sonic games, so whatever. Man, gets so old seeing these cutscenes and the loading screens between them uh, right after the first level. Because they're always the same regardless of uh, which level you finish or which mission you complete, or at least this one is. Uh, be, the one after it will be different depending on the world, which mission can be, though. The city is reporting significant damage and casualties. Among them, Westopolis has received the heaviest casualties due to its weakened defense system. Downtown Westopolis has been almost completely destroyed. Unconfirmed sources have also reported seeing a black hedgehog in Westopolis. Shadow? Deploy the troops now, and if you find Shadow with the Black Aliens, then kill them all. But sir, isn't Shadow on our side? I gave you an order, soldier. He's evil and he's the enemy. You know, you that guy's the only person on which I didn't think Heterochromia looked good. You're mine. Okay, some person with a round prejudice against us. Hooray. 
And cutscene. We get to have Black Doom nag us a bit for not listening to him. And if the game would load. Hello. Yeah, this game could use some preloading. Or at least loading during cutscenes. Instead of at instead of between them. Now that was sweet, Shadow. Yeah. Well I'm not here to save you. <laughs> I thought you might say something like that. How about a little friendly competition? Don't waste my time. Just like old times. We found the third chaos emerald in this city. Well thank you. Our mission here is done. Now get going. Guess that means Welcome to the next level. Let's go. Because fourth wall. All right then. So the hero mission for uh, this le particular level is actually pretty fun. Damn. That was the wrong down. Oh yeah, that's a game over, which is apparently a blackout. Because I actually... Uh, s spent so many lives trying to start over. So this time I'm just going... Leave all the way or something, I'm not sure. To be honest, maybe I'll give... Uh, destroying the tank another go. I don't expect much. For whatever reason, most pistols in this game act can actually be auto fired by holding uh, the square button, which I find particularly odd, since certain pistols don't usually do that. But whatever. So I actually got up here this up here this time. That helps a lot. I can do some extra damage. Okay, never mind. I think you it helps a lot if you are able to actually get up at that point. Or keep doing homie attack to follow the uh, tank right there. Otherwise, I think you just lose track of the tank. Stop saying the same thing. Of course it's different. Whatever it has in bolts in it now anyways. It's really annoying having lots of different types of guns. So of course it makes them. So I got a game over in the first episode. I just realized, wow. Man, this is a pathetic let's play it's turned out to be. I also just talk about something random. I find it kind of funny that I keep saying I don't care for the Sonic series at all. Uh, yet I keep, uh, this is my fifth or sixth uh, Sonic game that I've done a let's play of. And, uh, fourth in a row, I think. Third or fourth. But in the end, I'm actually just <laughs> doing a let's play of this to kind of get out of the way to to uh, not have any more Sonic games to do Let's Plays of. So I stop saying that I don't plan on doing Let's Plays of Sonic games. When I actually end up doing them anyways. That barrier isn't invincible. <laughs> I press the square button twice. So much ammo. Oh man, I have seen heard these lines and seen this part so many times. It's so old. Yeah, I mentioned that line earlier. 
And how Sonic says not to use Chaos Blast. You know you shouldn't be have shouldn't be have shouldn't have Chaos Blast in the first place if you're here anyways. Come on. Okay, so she'll just now turn green. It turns green and then it just disappears and then you uh Shadow, stop going that way! And then it just uh, disappears and you do damage the actual craft itself or something like that. Of course. It's not very really consistent with you hitting it with homie attacks. I really don't like this slide kick in this game because for one, whenever you hit something whilst doing it, you actually fall. You actually bounce. Or wait. No, that was a waste of bullet. Ah, uh, no, those guys have different weapons. This guy have? He does. Uh, oh, he doesn't. Awesome. Okay. Well then. Alright, so this is our last chance to destroy the tank. I'm quite positive will not be used very well. Oh, did I just destroy it? Okay, I'm surprised. Well, I took over a uh, half hour with that mission, in total. Well, I cut out the majority of it, but still. I won't allow them to do what they want to anymore. Anymore. Well. Perfect. I wasn't... I was actually kind of going for screw the grade, but... Hooray? I guess I can just, like, try to not be horrible in this Let's Play anymore. That's the end of this episode anyways, so... Go watch me be hor not be horrible later, hopefully. Bye, everyone!